Ina's in here, and welcome back to Far Cry 4. Now, we left off where the village was burning. Pagan men sent Royal Army troops over. I killed some of the helicopters, saved Badra. And now here I am on a hostage negotiation trying to save some um, civilians from the Royal Army. Which pretty much are Kirati traitors. Who side with Pagan men instead of the Golden Path. Or your dad, Mohan. So, let's go ahead and do it. Alright, Keep sliding down. God, I bet that'd be so fun. And dangerous, because, well, you don't really have a rope to strap onto. Or, like, a little, um, repel or grapple. Whatever the heck. You know what I'm trying to say. Alright, let's, keep, let's go. No enemies. Wait. I get... The environment gets me kind of um, mixed up a little bit. Let's go. Hit the gas pedal and get your ass up the mountain. Come on, ain't no time for that. You see what I mean? It's hard to control this thing. <laughs> I'm all over the freaking place. Just follow the road. That's what you gotta do. Just follow the road. Even if the situation's... Oh, wait. Okay. Every time you see a red car, that's a Royal Army car. Yeah. If you see one of those pass by, enemies. Always. Matter of fact, is that an enemy? No. See what I mean? I really thought that little flower right there was an enemy. And you know, most enemies in games are red. Yeah, they're usually in red uniforms. And the good guys, like myself, is in blue. Alright, almost there. Yeah, see, look. They're blue, the golden path. Almost there, just about 100, 100 more meters. Kill the guard, save at least two hearts. That's not too bad. I can do that. Oh, yeah, and you're probably wondering about the music. Well, before I start recording, yeah, this music was fine. It's just like when I start recording, it gets... The music's kind of loud when you, um... When you, um, play the game. So that's why I want to, um, turn it off. Because I'm trying to commentate, and, you know, the music's just going to be really distracting at the same time. But just let me know if you want me to turn it back on. You think I'm blind? No? I think you're crazy. that <laughs> My family has no money. Oh, poor guy. Whoa! Oh! Oh, yeah. Fuck! Uh. Uh. Well, I'm dead. Go ahead, kill me. Go ahead, kill me. Kill me now. There we go. Yeah, you killed me. You you, you can hear a little bit of their um the quotes that they say when they kill me. Like I killed him. I killed him! Yeah, these guys are crazy and psychopaths at the same time. Okay. Grapple back up. Grapple. See? I've done this so many times. Look at that. It's like wall running in Shard 4. That's how freaking fun it is. I can hear a girl crying. I better hurry up before she freaking weeps her freaking eyes out. I'm hurrying. I'm trying to get sighted again. I gotta spectate the area. Beehive. Okay, according to my calculations, that's about 50 more meters. And, accor and according to about 30 meters, or about um, 10, 10 meters, there's um, a charger, a, sh a shirtless um, person who just whacked a girl, and another 50 meters who's trying to get that... It looks like not the damn beehive, and another 50 meters is a freaking um, guard. Looks like he's taking a piss. Okay, girl, can you shut up? Stop with the. Ooh, 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 ooh. I think we're spending more money God. taking hostages than using. That's such a fake cry. What was that? I mean, if, I mean, if you keep crying like that, nobody's even gonna bother rescue you. They're just probably gonna say, "Shut up and slap they you." Can start killing us soon. Gotcha. <laughs> but, yeah. Throwing knives, yeah. Don't need those. Oh, I totally forgot I had my bow and arrow. Sorry about that. Uh, throw it at the beehive. Damn. Hope it won't kill any of the hostages over there. Help is on the way. Help is on the way. Well, I'm right here, buddy. Hey, you're gonna be okay. Look at me. No, look at me. You're gonna be okay. I'm right here. Yeah, you're gonna be alright. Jeez, you need a freaking 
take a breath, mate, because your breath's freaking strong. Oh, I got... I thought I got two people from that. Alright, uh... Gotcha! Perfect. Okay, the last guy's gotta be up here. Ooh. He knows there's something. He knows there's something. If I can even... I found the body! And shoot! God! Mm, look at him. He's just ready to freaking cut somebody. I know, right? There's never a reason to be like this. Okay. Go silent. Get him! Blade to blade. Okay. I'm tired. The hostages are safe, Sabal. You're doing your father's name proud, Ajay. This is what he wanted when he created the Golden Path. To help his people. Look, I didn't come here for my father or any of this. We could still use your help, brother. Look at the difference you've made. I know, I'm asking a lot from you, but helping the Golden Path will take you to Lakshmana. I promise you that. We'll find it together. Thanks, Sabal. Wow, that was like quite convincing from RJ to Sabal. Because, you know, all he wanted was um to take um um Ishwari back to, um... Uh, damn, what was that place? Uh, Lakshmana. Yeah, it was pretty much, like, a place where she was sacred and born. Or, like, a place she's always, um, been aware of. And Lakshmana, if you don't know, is actually, um, a AJ's half-sister. Yeah, if, if you, um, look at the ending, you'll know what I'm talking about. But I'm not, for the people that don't know anything about, about Far Cry, I got the burst for some weird reason. But, yeah, if some of y'all don't really know about Far Cry, for in the ending, yeah, you'll know when I get there. Ajay, it's Amita. It's gonna take a while, though. I know that Sabal put you up to rescuing the hostages instead of taking back the outpost. It's okay. You're new here, and Sabal can be very persuasive. I just wanted to do my part. And I appreciate that, but you have to see the bigger picture. I was already making arrangements to deal with the outpost, but now I have to retask my Ooh. fighters so they can protect the hostages you rescued. Protect them protect the from what? Deplore. And the royal army. He doesn't like losing his playthings. Don't you see, Ajay? Oh, there up. was a plan, and now it's fallen apart. Gotcha. It will be a while before things with the crew blow over. Meanwhile, the enemy soldiers in that outpost will have plenty of time to dig in. Not if I can help it. Ajay, attacking that outpost on your own would be suicide. Wait until we can give you the proper support. I can do this, Amita. Ajay, don't. Yeah, let me do what I want. Oh, yeah. Like I was saying, uh, careful, woman. Every lucky I can't shit your tires. Or I can't flatten them. But yeah, like I was saying, there was a, uh, uh, another karma, which pretty much, like I did in the other ones, help the rebels fight. That's karma, saving um hostages from the um, the royal army. Sometimes they'll be walking around with just one soldier. Soldier. Okay. With just one soldier, and uh, sometimes there'll be like more than one. Audrey, Audrey. Uh, yes. Awesome. Oh, just making sure you've been listening. Whoa, that just escalated very quickly. Begging a man's not playing. Matter of fact, he hasn't been playing since we since we even met him. The guy's a lunatic, and he's supposed to be my cousin or uh, uncle. Uh... I don't even know. Hell, I probably don't want to know. Get as much skin as you can. My lion taper. Never actually witnessed those in, in real life, but I pretty much know what they are now. There's the golden path. Yep, I've been seeing a lot of them lately. I'm actually kind of glad, because I haven't really been on the top of my game lately when it comes to stealth. Okay, go to this, um, she said outpost. She don't really want me to go to this outpost, but that's what we're going to do anyway, according to AJ. Now, I can see some all the way over there. You know what I like to do? You see that elephant? Yeah, you know, you know what I'm going to do. I'm going to cause chaos. But wait till I get down there. Wait, is there a repel? Ah, damn it. I just lost my freaking... Come on, AJ. Get back! AJ. Mother. Uh, huh. Grr. Bro. Ajay, just forgot 
Yes. Mm. I wish I had a slap in the face button. I could just be like, oh, fuck. I could just be like that all over your face every time you don't want to listen to me. And that's what he gets. Sliding down a mountain, you get a you get a bruise on the shoulder. Outpost, yeah, I know. Do that without getting um sighted or noticed, and you'll get a good achievement. Or you'll get a lot of XP. Cause look, I got three. Now this one, soft landing, yeah, that's pretty good. Two outposts without being detected. You're gonna need that. Cause there's gonna be some falls in the future that yeah, you will be able to um not really survive because they're really they're so high up okay bullet sponge yeah I'm gonna need that body armor now the heavy takedown is really essential as well if you see like a little uh one of those little symbols peg and mince wrath convoy you you can't do that unless you you can't get the skill it's for it's for um skill points or XP so if you you can't get that unless you've done Pagan's Wrath. Just gonna go ahead and let you know that, just in case if you were wondering. I know some people haven't played Far Cry, and if you have it, you're kind of missing out. So I'm just gonna go ahead and let you know. Okay. Uh, hang on. Okay, watch what I'm gonna do. You see that lock right there? Now watch. Watch. Yep, I'm gonna let all chaos. That elephant's my bitch. Look at him. I don't have to do anything. They ain't gonna kill that elephant. You know, you know how much freaking damage that thing takes in real life? Probably not much in this game, but probably a whole bunch in real life. Come on, get the last guy, wherever he is. Just get him. Yeah, yeah, I, I want to know where he's at too. Yeah, I might have to go get him. I don't want to get sighted. Either that or he's probably camping somewhere. Probably inside the house. Whoa. Yeah, he saw him now. Uh, you know what? Uh, get him, elephant! Get! Ellie, come on! Yeah, that's my new elephant's name, Ellie. Not you, Ellie, from The Last of Us, no. Golden Path, y'all a little too late. I just hate how they show up at the last moment. First the hostages, then the outpost. You're not much of a listener, Ajay, but I have to admit, you've done a good job today. Thanks. It just felt like the right thing to do. Your mother would be proud. You want to reach, uh, what is it, Lakshmana? Mm. Getting there won't be easy. We lost the north to pagan men years ago and we're struggling here in the south. I promised my mom I'd bring her ashes there. It was her dying wish. Think about it, Ajay. Your mother knew exactly what would happen once you showed up here in Kirat. The son of Mohan Gale returning to the war-torn land of his birth. <laughs> Ishwari was a smart woman. You being here and helping our cause is no accident. Stand with us, Ajay. Join the Golden Path and I promise you, you will fulfill your mother's dying wish. Whether it was to spread her ashes at Lakshmana or to accomplish something greater. Did my parents really start the Golden Path? They did. Their goal was to free Kirat from Pagan's regime. Now you have a chance to help us finish the work they started. Just think about it, Ajay. Oh, Mom. Looks like we're staying. At one complete.
All right. Yeah, every time you complete an outpost, you get one of those little um, green symbols. Little side missions, side quests. Play co-op? Nah. I don't really... They ain't really no part of even playing co-op. I mean, GTA, yeah, but... I mean, Far Cry, it's a big game. Well, GTA is too, but... It's it's fun with just one person. Or my my personal opinion. Okay. Now, you know what? They ain't gonna be calling for reinforcements anytime soon. Especially the Golden Path. Those freaking late soldiers who can't even protect themselves from a few freaking animals. Okay. Journal, Mohan. You didn't read. Namaste. You didn't read it, did you? Nah. How pretty you are, I I doubt it. Girl, it's like freaking hot outside, and you're freaking begging for warmth. I mean, are you? Hey, turn around so I can get a side mission. My friends, they took them. I don't know why. They're forcing them to work. I think. Please save them. I'll get them back. Yeah. Let's do it, RJ. Let's go. Let you fast travel, reset to change time of day. Yep. Done. Been there, done that. There's a lot of that happening in this game. You're gonna be fast traveling a lot. Yeah, bonus XP. Oh, look. See, you automatically get four. Are you, as soon as you clear an outpost, that's like a lot of XP. But you know what? I'm gonna get death from above. Or, you know what? Get throwing knife. That's a very critical one. And, uh, death from above. Those two are pretty important. This one is probably the second important. This, this is probably the most important. The, oh, no, 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 no. Chain takedown is the most important. Yeah. That's a very, very critical one to get. It's kind of unpredictable, though, because this, this, the retaliation is very, um, it's like you get what you get. Sometimes it'll happen. It's it basically is um, one of the Golden Path soldiers will call for um, help to secure the um, outpost that the Royal Army tried to take back from you that you already took. And yeah, it's, it's karma. And yeah, what, if you you have to fight off some soldiers, fight them off, and once they retreat, you get the karma. Or you complete karma, and uh, you get um, the little skill or the little. When it's locked, it appears. Or the little, yeah, the little symbol, the little dot, dot, dot thing, it appears. But you gotta um, get the other skills before you can get to that one. Okay, I see one all the way down there. There's a yak. I probably need to kill one of them. I don't even think I even got one of those yet. And matter of fact, I need to, I need to, uh, wait, yeah. Throwable bag, probably gonna need that. Yak bait bag. I don't really think the bait bag is probably even. I hardly ever use the bait bag because, well, unless I'm like desperate for some skins and like to get someone to get some of those um unlockables or locked locked stuff. Whoa, that guy looks like he's alerted. And try not to run when he's looking at you because you are extremely noticed. Look, look how noted. Look how noticed you are. So we gotta try not to do that. Unless you like, unless you get a skill where a uh, reduced noise. Whoa, I hit him right in the, are you sick? Gotcha, gotcha in the tail. Shit. Ah, uh, I'm gonna have to restart. Yeah, I know what you're saying. Um, Ian, why are you doing that? Well. I don't really, I'm not really, um, I don't like all the hosts just being dead, because, well, it's just, it just don't seem right. I know. Oh, yeah, as soon as you, uh, restart a quest, the skins just go away. Because they know people are going to do that, so that's why they're going to make it a little tougher. That scared me a little bit. So there's exactly four hostages. There's always going to be four. Or there's always going to be four, um, diamonds. Sometimes there'll be, like, five, but some of them won't count as hostages. Yep, there. Jesus Christ, how much do you take? Don't. I was about to say, don't shoot the hook. Don't. 
Hit the horses. Cause that would be bad. Okay, I can upgrade now. Uh, throwable bag. Oh, dull skin. Yep, see what I mean? That's why you want to go ahead and just get random animal skins, because you never know when you might need them. Bengal tiger. Haven't um, really encountered those yet. But, yeah, they're they're pretty tough. They're pretty tough to kill. But, I mean, they're not impossible, but sometimes they're really unexpected. Okay, there's one over there. This is, this is the toughest guy. Because, yeah, he's in the house, and, yeah. He could easily do a quick turn. We'll get the money eventually. Just steal it. Did I steal it? I they mean, uh... Um, yeah, steal it. Okay, where's the last guy? The last guy's usually... Yeah, he's usually always over there. Damn, right in the skull. Now, hang on. You're dead. Get Please. up, you freaking... Take this for saving us. Get up. Have this. Get up, man. Thanks. You Boy. can do... That escalated quickly. 22,000 rupees? This is all I oh, I hear some karma too. Run! Let's go! I can only give yeah, you yeah, yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you. God must be looking out for me. I know. I love you, God. I always will. Okay. Let's keep moving. I need to um, get that karma. Because karma's <sighs> really. I thought it stopped for a second. Oh, God. And I hate the locations that they get put in. Yeah, I know what karma is. AJ, I'm about to say, he better get up there. Whoa, chill out. Some of the freaking quotes they say in this game are just like, really, you need to chill your ass out. Like this, like that right there. Yeah, neither do you. Yes. Got you. Whoa. Oh! I freaking recorded that. Get the shotgun. Get the... You're really just gonna charge him even though I just killed your dead buddy. You a stupid little doggy. Okay. Skin it. Or just get the skin. This was a clean kill, I know. Ah. Was it? Yeah. Loot bag almost full. Uh, don't worry about that. I mean, you can always get enough. Uh, where is it? Yeah, loot bag. I mean, that's like three pigskin. Pigskins, they're not that hard to kill. Matter of fact, like one shot for like with any weapon, they go down. Okay, taper. Yeah, I think I saw one of those being a certain, a certain monkey. Probably gonna need one of those. Yeah, cause I need like one. Come here. Come here. Just come here, please. Stuck. H8 for the love of... Where's, where'd he go? Come here. Damn, I bet that's loud. Especially in real life. Hey, look how fast they run. Oh. Yeah, see what I mean? They always... You always gotta be aware Um, in Far Cry. Because they could put two random soldiers in a certain area. Sometimes... Most of the time, they're walking down the road. Just like one in the front, one in the back. So they'll like get you aware because you don't think there'll be any enemies around. But yeah, they put two in there to make you um cautious and make you um want to keep playing. Go, go, go. Because you, you think it's going to be simple, but it's not. Trust me. My first time playing this game, I did not expect that. Going for him. Yeah, come for me. I'm going to get your freaking ass. Oh yeah, throw the knife. Did that freaking knife just do a damn curve? Okay. So, yeah, pig. Definitely gonna need to get those. Hurry up. Okay, got one of them. Get like. Taper, I don't need you. Uh, if I got a clean kill. I didn't get one with a shotgun, but. Yeah, you see a little wrench at the bottom? I'm almost out of um, loot. Okay. Hang on. Pigs get loot. I'm saving it for that. Quiver. Uh, for. I want another one of those. Uh, I want more loot. I don't care about a quiver. Well, 
I do care about it. I mean, I try to get as much as I possibly can. I mean, I I try to upload or I try to uh, upgrade almost all of them. But yeah, see what I mean? I'm a bit of completionist. I get as much stuff as I possibly can. If I see it, I get it. If there's enemy enemies that are still alive, I'll kill them. It don't matter who they are. Just saying. Okay, keep running. Keep running, Aj. Aj. Ooh, barrel. Barrel. Run. God. God, did you hear that sound? <laughs> okay, where do the other ones go? Ah, screw them. They probably went to go jump in some barrels. That was bad, I know. Okay. Anyway. Okay. Oh, yeah, and the little H. You want to guess who that is? Yep. Hurt. Not Hercules, Herc. That big, annoying, bearded butt bandana guy. This guy right here. He's from 3 and Primal. Did we miss it? Dude, no! We did not just miss the action! Have we met? Man, I'm the cavalry, man. I was gonna roll him here like goddamn Clint Eastwood. I'm Herc. I heard about you, man. Taking names and writing checks out to kick it ass, man. That's why I'm here. Because you and me together. Golden Path won't know what hit them right in their faces. We are the Golden Path. Man, I do not understand what you are saying. I don't speak your language. I think what you meant to say is that uh, the Royal Army won't know what hit them. See, we're, we're the Golden Path. Dude, seriously? These guys have been giving me a lot of stank eye over the things I've been saying about the Golden Path, so that makes sense. Okay, new plan then. Preemptive cavalry, that's right. You need help, you call, we swoop in and help you, me or my, uh, uh... Golden Path? Golden Path buddies, that's right. You and me, man, new and improved tap bros, that's right, living the dream. Come on, punch it in. Boom! I wear french fries, you stay potato, that's all right. You kind of came in on the slow bus too, but you got there, so I got respect for that. I'm gonna see you around though, okay? Okay, let's roll, Golden Path, homie! Woo! Okay, then. Ugh, what a freak. Yeah, look at him right there trying to be nice. I mean, Herc ain't really a bad guy, but he's just extremely annoying. Especially when you do his missions. And yeah, I might actually do those, if I can even access them. Which I'm pretty sure I can. Okay, but anyway, uh... Or you know what, just get the quicker. Clouded Leper. Okay, now I'm gonna show you what happens when you throw the bait. You'll gain an animal, but you'll get like a random animal. It depends on where the cli what the climate is. Or the sound of the animal. I don't hear anything. Yeah. Ooh, wait. Leopard. Where is it? That's the, that's a clouded leopard. Look at this thing. I hit that thing right in the face. Damn. Look at that bitch's face. Look at the eyes. Damn. That's what I mean. The game's really unpredictable with um certain um enemies and animals. Okay, throw it. Get another one. There's a pig up there. Whoa! That bear just came out of the damn rock wall. You see what I mean? You'll just get you get whatever you get. So if you're that desperate to upgrade some stuff in your um in your um inventory, that's what you can do. You can just um throw bait, lure animals, and yeah, you can just automatically get some skins there and there. Bear, yeah, you're gonna be needing a lot of those. Okay, there's some pig skin. I'm gonna need to get at least one um uh clean kill. And boom. Don't move, I got that one too. Damn, that's such a good shot. But yeah, you only get five um KP. Because well, they're harmless animals. The more deadly they are, and the more stronger they are, the more, um, um, KP you get. It's a barrel. 
Look at that eagle. Look at that. Look. Look at that. Hang on. Wait, hang on. I, I need to get a good view. Look. Look at it. Hang on. Look at him. Mmm. Eagles are strong, man. King of all birds. And they will always be some. They fly where other um, birds dare. Okay, loot bag. Demon fish. Yep. You're probably... Well, it's a fish, but... The first time I saw this um, thing, I was literally... I got scared because, well, I didn't know what it was. A demon fish? I thought it was like a devil fish. Like, horns and stuff. I literally thought that when I was a kid. Because, you know, it was my first time playing. I didn't really know what to expect. <laughs> but... Um... Hang on. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go to, uh, here, Bonapur, and get this, uh, Kirati Films Racing. Because I want to show you this cutscene. And, um, once, once you watch it, it'll start, um, showing up in certain outposts. I think in every single one of them, but... It, yeah, I'm pretty sure it is in every one of them. Okay, and here's when you, um, trade or get new weapons, when you un want to unlock them. This is where they all are. That and that um other guy. Oh yeah, and the um the yellow or the gold, it's like upgrades or special weapons. It's pretty much like the same weapons you unlock. Like the normal weapons except like they got like attachables like a silencer, a zoom, a reflex sight, um a hybrid, a cog, stuff like that. Yeah, see, buy and customize. Well, they're like that, you have to reach karma level 4, or... I know some signature weapons that are, like, very, very powerful. Like the, uh... Damn, what is it? Recurve bow, that's a really strong gun. Yes, yeah, see, complete more campaign missions to unlock this, or liberate 15 more bell towers to get it for free. That's... See, the stronger they are, the more, um, they cost. Or the more stuff you gotta do. Oh, yeah, and signatures... Um, bell towers. That's pretty much every single one of them in this game. I've, I've tried out every one of them. The bed, yep. You can, you can look at your watch on your um, on your wrist and set the time for like whatever it is. I don't really see the need to even do that because, well, I just find it kind of unnecessary. Unless you want to make it like a real life type thing. Like when it gets dark, you go to bed at a certain point and then... In the first day, you want to, uh, just... Or the next morning, you get up and do your thing in life. So, let's go talk to this woman and see what she's got to offer. This is quite funny, but... And quite cringy, too. Hello. Uh, I got a message someone here wanted to meet me. Yes. Hello, hello, hello. Sharma Salsa, founder, CEO, and owner of Karate International Association of Films, Karate Film Directors, and the Actors Guild of Kirat. Pleased to meet you, darling. I'm AJ. It's my pleasure. Don't be silly, sweetheart. It isn't every day you meet such a stunning young man. Why, you remind me of the late, great Riti Nin Riti Kapoor, one of Kirati's film's finest. But that was long ago. <laughs> I'm still very much into the karate film scene, don't get me wrong. But that's not where the audience is anymore, or the money. Go, bro. This is where the audience is. Flying off cliffs, quadding rivers, enduring epic wipeouts. You're doing that for free right now anyway, right, sweetheart? All I need you to do is film yourself on a few races I've set up. I'll produce. We'll upload the final product. And then watch the money roll in. I guess. Yeah, sure. You're going to be a star. <laughs> yeah, see what I mean? It's kind of cringy, though, because, well... Did you hear in the background she was listening to Asian porn? Or vintage porn? 
Because you heard all the moans and... Yeah. And she acted like she had a crush on me. Because, well... AJ... I'm just going to go ahead and say it right now. AJ is handsome. Or, should I say, Adonis. AJ, Adonis... Adonis means really handsome, if you don't know that. But, yeah, I just want to go ahead and say it. I'm just giving them a compliment. It's not actual, like, relationship type thing. Alright, let's uh, fast travel back here and uh, do this mission. What What's it called? Um, Hilana Bazaar. Yeah, some of these freaking names are bizarre, aren't they? Throw rocks to distract on Gale's legacy. Hello, woman. Okay. Open it up. Ah! Hell, let me do this karma. Yeah, every single karma I hear, I'm doing it. Because, well, it's worth doing. Unless you get to, like, level 8. That's, like, the max you can get. Hurry up. Ah, there's only one person left. I gotta hurry up. And look at all the people on the freaking golden path. Oh, yeah. Mm. I hate That's the thing that pisses me off about um, the freaking karma. When you're fighting How are you doing, Ajay? Not too good. Or now. But it is the gods. Because well Because hang on. It's like when you're trying to complete a karma and some of the um like for one when you're trying to help the rebels fight and you know they're all killing the royal army, and you you just you gotta kill at least one for it to count as um um KP karma points. But don't you just hate it when you travel a long way to get over there, and then they end up killing all the enemies, and you can't get one single bit of karma? That just really burns me about some of the stuff. But some of these are pretty ooh ooh equal. I want to go ahead and get that because yeah, it's gonna become a problem. Feathers. Ain't really worth it, because you don't really need it. Unless you just really want to. Okay. And this is where the mission starts, and... Yep. Now, this game has choices. And I'm going to talk about when this is over. No! You're a I would not want to walk in there right now. What are they arguing about? Pagan Min soldiers are about to attack one of our camps. Amida thinks our priority should be the information the fighters have gathered. Sabal thinks saving our people is more important. How long have they been at it? Long enough. The argument never changes and their positions never move. Look, I don't want to bother you, but you're Ajay Gale, right? <laughs> Thank you for helping us. Everyone here appreciates it. I owe Golden Path for rescuing me, but honestly, I'm just... I'm just here to scatter my mother's ashes. Perhaps. But now you see what Pagan has done to this country. You are the son of Mohan Gale. Like it or not, your duty is Kirat. And your choices will carry weight. We need someone to break the stalemate between Amita and Sabal. Keep that in mind when you're in there. This is about lives. We don't act people will die. This is about war. We need that intel. We're talking about soldiers we can use. Remember what you said about DARPA? And if I had a choice between Darpen and the intelligence, I choose the intel. <sighs> okay, so choices. Now, this depends on um, which endings you get. If you, if you side with Amita or Sabal, you get, like, a certain reaction or, like, a certain... I mean, the story will still go on in the same manner, like, it's the sa same missions, but certain reactions from Amita or Sabal will either t will take place. So if you choose... Um, 
Sabal over Amita, then you'll get Amita's reaction. And if you choose Amita for Sabal, yeah, you'll get his reaction. So, balanced power missions are critical to the Golden Path, but Amita and Sabal have different goals. And speak with both leaders and choose who to support your choice with. So, yeah, that's you in the middle. AJ Gale or AJ Gale choosing to sell with um, Sabal or uh, Amita. And this will also create new objectives in upcoming missions and um, dictate the leader of the Golden Path until the next bounce pa of power mission. So, what I like to do is, I usually choose Amita, but, you know, Sabal's would kind of make more sense because, you know, you've been friends for him for a little while, even though it's like in the beginning, um, you kind of trust him a little bit more than Amita because Amita's kind of been riding over you lately. I mean, I know Sabal has been too, but still, I just feel like Sabal would be a good choice for the very first one. So, let's go ahead and do it. How can I help? One of our camps is about to get overrun. Don't know when, but it could get messy. I need to send them all the support I can. So, if you want to help, get over there, brother. Bounce power. Sabal wants you to protect the rebels at the nearby Golden Pass. So you can decline or accept. I'll accept. The rebel yell. Alright. Now, it's... Some of these missions are the exact same throughout the game, but are like some of them are like different variants. Like... It's the same mission or, or like same little objective, but the objectives are kind of different. Like, sometimes you might have to go stealthy, sometimes you might have to go out loud. Like, I know for Amita, you go stealthy. Okay, there's some royal army right there. Uh, and, uh, Sabal... for another canteen. Can never have too much water. Okay, then. Get ready to have enough blood. Boar. Ah, uh, you can't really... Can I s no, you can't skin it. Find that weird. Okay. Barrel. Gotcha. I'm a good shot. Always will be. Okay, skin it. Barrel skin. Okay, keep on running. Whoa! Cloud clouded leopard. Fuck, I hate these things so much. They are a pain in the ass. The leopards are like the most annoying um, predator in the game. Because they are so fast. And yeah, they will chase you down until you die. Honey badger. Yeah, honey badgers are quite annoying too. Even though their sizes... Even though they're small in size... I just find it weird how... You know, like... They're... They're... If you if you play Far Cry Primal, okay, there's another karma. There's a lot of karma in this mission. And when you're on your way to the mission, you encounter um. There was a wheel. There was a wheel back there. Wheel right there. And sometimes there's karma right here. Most of the time there is, but sometimes there isn't. Hey, ah. hang on. I don't want to make any noise. Cause yeah, it's really hard to be stealthy on this um karma. One thing, you don't have the chain takedown. Yeah, but the chain re chain takedown is very, very important. Sometimes you might get it, sometimes you might not. But most of the time, I get it. Even though it will take a while, I always want to get it. Okay. Now use the um gun. Jeez. I bet that is so loud, you can't even imagine. Alright. Now, if you see smoke, that means, um, that's an outpost. God, there's more Royal Army. This is probably the most there's ever been. Hurry up and kill him. See what I mean? My stealth's getting better. Okay, keep on running. Depend on how long this might take, I might have to cut it until I get there. 
But, yeah, see what I mean? There's a lot of karma when you come down here. Or on the way to this mission. Okay, so this is a hostage rescue. Most of the time it's just one person, um, yeah, guarding somebody. And yeah, just walking down the road. Or sometimes there's like two people on the ground kneel kneeling and there's like certain types of enemies guarding them. Get your ass out of here. Alright, now get out of here. I thought for sure I was finished. I am in your debt. You too. Pretty cool with them sunglasses on. God. Outpost. Might as well just do that. While I'm here. New guns for hire. Okay. So I thought they're already getting attacked. Oh yeah, you see that thing on the radar? It's a cargo. Now this is really not necessary at all. Yep. Get him, elephant. Gotcha. Hurry up. I gotta freaking get to a bush. Okay. Uh, lower, lower freaking animal over here. Don't attack me, please. Hurry. Get one of them. Just keep attacking them. Clouded leopard. Wow. That's hardly ever a clouded leopard down this far. Gotcha. Did that count as stealth? Yes, it did. Kira T. Way Station. So good. So freaking good. Okay. There's a beehive over there. Wait. Where's the, um... Where's the clouded... Wait, did I already skin it? I think I did. Uh, I'm pretty sure I did. Oh, yeah, and it was one of the Kir um, Kiraki Fashion Week. So, yeah. If you... If you can't, um... Okay, Beehive. Now, you can either, um, take this to the outpost or destroy it. I'm gonna go ahead and take it. Because, well, the outpost is right here. And, you know, there ain't really no point of even destroying it. Fight, brother. Feel free to take down more outposts for the Golden Path. Yeah, will do. I love, that's what I do. That's what I do for my job. Okay, I got it. I hardly ever do that, but, yeah, most of the time I destroy them. Am I speaking with a Jake Holly? Who is this? No time to explain. Meet me at my studio post haste. Okay. Now. Please, help me. Now, this is another hostage rescue. See what I mean? Certain types of barriers are, I am uh, hostage. Yeah, I know that. They're holding my friends hostage. You have to save them. I'll take care of it. Okay, I'm, I'm starting to worry about this outpost more than the damn mission. But hopefully it'll get me a little closer to it. If this takes too long, I'll edit some parts out. Because I try to leave as much stuff as I, um, I can in. But, you know, just certain parts I just, I like to leave in because, well, I just think they're I awesome. I just heard you delivered a truck full of supplies. Well done, brother. Well done. We'll see this gets to the right people. Alright, reach the hostages. I pretty much remember what they are, what um, every single hostage rescue even looks like, or the setting of it. I pretty much remember every one of them, because I played this game so many times. You see, look at all of them. You can easily get away with this one, because their backs are turned. Except, except that one guy. Hurry! I don't want that guy to get knocked up against the freaking wall. Understand? Okay, hurry up. We'll discuss. How much longer do we have to guard them? Not anymore. <laughs> that guy died with a freaking condom. Are you serious? Oh, look, it actually did lure me towards the, um, the mission. A little closer to it. Okay, keep on running. Uh, yeah, you can fix up trucks and uh, people that are in need of help. Okay, I'm gonna make it quick though. But watch, just watch this. This is kind of hilarious. 
Yeah, just look. That's, this is all I'm doing. Boom. Okay. Fixed. Thank you for helping out there. They keep kidnapping people to use as slave labor or for sport. Free as many as you can. You got it, Sabal. See what I mean? The guy's a good guy. That's why I want to go ahead and um, um, work for him first. Then, um, then Amita. Worry about Amita later on. Because, you know, we haven't really been seeing much of her lately. Okay. We're getting close. Golden Path Camp. Yeah. If this was Amita's, these guys wouldn't be here. They'd be all dead. Ajay, so glad to see you. We're ready for the bastards. So grab mines or get behind the turret. Let's hurt them. You said it. Yeah, hunters are very annoying. Because, well, they can, um... They can make, um, animals on their side. Like, they're like, whisper Remember, to them. They can come from any direction. Yeah, I know that. So, yeah, just pretty much throw them anywhere. But don't, but don't throw them as where the golden path are, Where the golden path are gonna be. Because, yeah, you don't want them... You don't want them getting hurt. You want as much, you want as almost every single one of them to survive or live. Bring it, I'm ready. I ain't got any mods? Be ready for anything. Oh, I do have a mod. Just press on the dialogue stick and you'll get one. Okay. Hunters! Hunters are coming! Get, move. Hunters! Stay alert. Down. Yeah, dang right. The good thing is they got arrows. So they're kind of... They're not that bad, um, they don't take as much damage, but they're, damn, one of them already got killed. That's what happens when you, um, abandon your squad. But they, they do kind of take a little bit of, um, they do a lot of damage on you, but, but sometimes they do. I didn't sneeze, but okay. I'm in the face. Where? Ooh. And the dumb thing is, er, the thing that kind of um, is really annoying is there's, they don't, there is no hit detection. Like they don't show that at all. Like when there's an, uh, yep. That's why I hate the eagles. Hurry up. Come on, hurry. I ain't got time for this. Stop shooting the eagle and we're about the hunters. Where is it? Just kill the guy. Gotcha. Wait. Gotcha. Wrap and heal. Yeah, you do that. Whoa, where are they at? Where are they? Yeah, dang right we are. Okay. Now we gotta go to the next area. Sabal, the camp is safe. Okay, brother. Head to the other camp and see what you can do. Yeah, if this was a meet us, we'd be going stealthy. Uh, Hunters are a serious threat. They've killed many of my friends. Now see, look. Now look what they did. Did you see that little, um, wolf? You probably did it, but... You know what I'm talking about. They, um... They, uh, make animals on their side. Instead of attacking anybody they want, they can go for anybody they want. Yeah, like I said, look. Fireers can turn animals against you. Yeah, they can... T yeah, see, look. Instead of attacking them, they attack me. They won't attack any of the enemies. No matter what side they're on. They won't attack none of the Royal Guard. Or the army. Okay. Be careful, because there is a few snakes. Get, get out of here. The eagle, yeah, they can do that to every animal. I hear a snake. Where is it? Where is it? I hear you. It's going to scare me as soon as I get into it. Hang on. I hear you. Come on. That thing's probably like right next to me. Yeah. 
It's near. Come on, man. Just come out. Uh, wait. Please show yourself. Ah, screw it. Screw it. I don't want to waste my time with that. Okay, now this is where the, um, the, there's going to be some more up here. More snakes, more animals. Yep. I don't know where that is. They just put them in weird locations because they're, they're green snakes and... Oh yeah, and um... Uh, when hunters sight you, they make that whistling noise of... I can't whistle that great. Something like that, but yeah. And there's no um, detection meter. Because, well, that makes sense because they are hunters and hunters are quiet. They communicate with whistles. Hurry up. Yeah, and some of the healing, um, the healing techniques, um, are pretty, um, cool. It depends on which one you got. Wow, you are a crazy man. Hurry, I don't want to die this late in the game. God, I can't, it was... Hurry. Hurry up. Oh, uh, they killed my brothers. And yeah. Whoa, it's damaging itself. Just get out. I'm done with you. You too. It's been in the same place every time. Is that it? No, no. It'd be saying, um, thank you, RJ, for helping our people. That's what they'd be saying. Ugh. Come out. Bear. Look at that monstrosity. You know what? Just get the skin. That's the only reason why I wanted to kill is to get the skin. Uh. Hurry. Where's the other guy? Come on, man. Just come out. I ain't got time to deal with you. I'm trying to communicate with my whistle. Where are you? Come out, Hunter. Don't be going stealthy on me. Only I can do that. Come on. Yeah, the thing that makes it tough is there's a lot of fog and mist and shit. So yeah, that makes it a little tougher. Is that it? Or... I mean... Whoa! Come on! Yeah, see what I mean? You gotta kill all of them. Rebel yell. And that's it for the mission. Sabal, it's done. But whatever Amita was looking for isn't here. It doesn't matter, brother. You saved lives. I knew you had this. Jomohan's blood. A real son of Kira. Alright. I'll forget that little uh, karma thing. But anyway, that's it. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you on the next video for where we take on the next mission with Amita or Sabal. And maybe do some more combo points, um, skin more animals, and do some more outposts and radio towers. So, I'll see y'all then. Ian's out.